Welcome everyone to another exciting episode of Xenosaga 3. We're going to be making our way through Milsha during the Milshian conflict and seeing what's going on there, as well as heading to the church to try to find the young version of Xion. It's going to be a very heavy st episode today once we get to the actual story content, so I hope you guys are looking forward to it. This is one of my favorite parts of the series, so I'm excited to see all of your reactions, so let's get into this. No... No. Yeah, I haven't used steel this entire playthrough. We need to heal. Engaging he has no output. EP. Let me go back inside the building so we can go to that save point really quickly. I forgot to turn my mic back up and the game volume down. My mistake. Yeah, I'm sorry for that out-of-context joke. I thought it would just be funny, but apparently it actually made people upset. I'm sorry. <laughs> be on guard. All right. Look, I need to hit you from behind. Stop. Stop chasing me. Turn around. No, stop that. Engaging no, it's fine. I don't care. Get broken. Get broken. That's right. Don't use grip attack on me. Be busker. Alright. So our next destination is the church. Uh, what do I want to do with you? I don't even know. These things are weak to fire, or at least this guy is. Is that beam bolt or fire? It was fire bolt. Epic. That will break. This man is one shot. I love Ziggy. I love Ziggy so much. Oh yeah, we can use Fallen Eagle on these guys. That's right. I haven't seen Shion suplex a dude in a while. All systems functioning normally. I, I don't think the joke was that bad, honestly, but we'll be safe and edit it out, I guess. Be on guard. Uh. I want to look at something really quickly, though. Um... Alright, I gotta go back through the city while everything's falling apart. Um, I want to check something here. Okay, apparently there's a, um, shop coming up I want to do something with later. Sorry from chaos. Because <laughs> if you remember the beginning of Xeno Saga 2, I think that was chaos in the crap. Oh man, I love when the past versions of ourselves cause trouble for us. 
Oh my gosh. Dude, I love Ziggy. Why is he like the strongest character in this game? So epic. Lunar Blade. Why is this the best move in the game? Why is Devil Break the best move, like, actually? Not only is it our most powerful attack, but it also does a billion break damage. Because why not? Why not? Speaking of stuff, I haven't even leveled up my skills in a while, have I? I completely forgot to do that before the Pelagree fight! <laughs> Guess it didn't matter, but look at all this EP I've got. We were already um, using Alan, though, so I mean... We were already not being very optimal, were we? Um, he's got a devil break. All right, pretty good. Keon. Cosmo. I want to get closer to those master skills if we can. Type in critical, that's going to be useful. Drink plus two, okay. Yeah, we didn't need, we didn't need skills, because we had Alan, he was carrying us. Naturally, if you're having trouble with those fights, don't use Alan, he's by far the worst character. But, I couldn't just not use him. Um, hit Blizzard 2 and Lightning 2, I guess. Thunderbolt 2, Ice Bolt, that's fine. Chaos. Okay, that's gonna cover my skills for now. That'll cover that, I think. I don't want to fight every I think that's going to count as attack from behind. And there's four enemies and I can't boost anyone. Don't kill me. Ow. Please don't kill me. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. At least I can run away really fast from encounters in this game. Alright, Momo, heal everyone. Oh gosh, big robot. Be calm. Let's get the behind attack against you guys. I don't want to fight you from the front. Turn around. There you go. There you go. Perfect. Be calm. Um, tech, and of course you can't use Fallen Eagle. What are you guys weak to? Um, beam and... Is that beam? No, I think beam's on the end, isn't it? It's thunder and ice for week two. I do not have thunder or ice. That's unfortunate. Okay, Shion, just use um lunar blade. I don't know. Give your 100 damage. That will break. That did not break. Feels bad. I only did half his break damage that time. Now we're fighting some strong enemies here. Man. Nice crit. Royal Sword too. Um uh, Howard Wow. Okay, there we go. There's the break. There's the break. Um, how much damage do you do to them again with this? I think this will be enough. Eliminating. Yeah, epic. 1,500. Pretty good. Hey. 
Yeah, these enemies have a lot of health. These are probably the most annoying enemies we've ran into so far. But, we do have, um, good ways to break enemies, so that's fine. So we don't have Alan's big shot at- speaking of- ah, crap. Broke Ziggy, that's not good for us at all, is it? Um... Well? I'm doing great, Stormwolf. He's back up, at least. Hmm. And, uh, I, I don't think I can risk the next attack yet. Or the special attack yet. I think... Eh, we'll play it safe. He shot... Eliminated. A severed deer head. Interesting. All systems function. Awesome. Okay. I can help, but I don't want to fight too many of those enemies. Nice skill upgrade, eh? Maximum output! Better report 01. I think we can, there's a lot of those we can get. I don't know if they're like actually that useful though. So they go around and search for them all. Better report 04. I don't remember what these what these are used for. I kind of just want to continue the story though. Not gonna lie. By the way, does anyone remember what the next enemy is weak? The next boss enemy is weak to? Like what element he's weak to? Here we go. Why can't you use Fallen Eagle on the Utix soldiers? They're human enemies, right? I have no idea anymore. Whatever, it's fine. Um... Alright, epic. Slash him, Shion! Get him! Alright. be using other special attacks, but I just like shooting them with the Gatling gun too much. All system. All right. Acquired lock shot, and Jin got Raging C. Raging C is actually a really nice move. It's an AOE attack that would actually probably be really helpful against some of these enemies. Engaging with maximum output. He is weak to fire. Um, let me check. In that case... Actually, we can change that a little bit later. I want to put the fire ring on him for sure. I want to put Ziggy in the party for a second. Or not Ziggy, um, Jin in the party for a second. Oh, hold on. Alright, so we got Raging C. Physical attack that hits all. Really good for getting that boost meter. We already got, we got like a full meter. I know you can't really see it well because my camera's in the way, but we got like a full meter of boost just from that move. So that's a very nice move. And just doing um, damage to everyone in general is actually really nice. Well, 
What do you get if you get all the federal reports, by the way? I don't remember. Oh, dang. Rip Shion. You got a breaker. Why you got a breaker like that? Um, armor pierce? I didn't do much. Wait, you boost it? You boost it? You can't do this to me. Okay, you're just gonna break my entire party. I got it now. Dang, man. We're getting wrecked by this thing. There was my entire party. Oh, Shion's back, don't worry. Stop that! Are you really about to combo her again? Okay, no. Okay, I was about to get... I thought that was their game was about to troll me so hard. Um... I don't know if this will be enough or not. It was not. Well, this thing's really tanky. Dang, it has like 2,000 health, I guess. More than that. Bruh. Why is this enemy so hard? I should not have let, let Ziggy leave my party. No, we don't need Raging Sea right now. It's fine. Not much time left. Let's hurry. Um, to think I'd lose my favorite spot like this. What a waste. Now that I think about it, I don't need this file I received here anymore. Anyway, I'll give it to you. Better report number five. What do you get if you get all of these again? Because I really don't want to get all of these. Don't underestimate me. Hmm. What if we went up to the top? Up here. You're the ones who got my balloon back, aren't you? Thank you. I'm going back to the sky. Just like my balloon. Thank you so much for that time. This is really goodbye, isn't it? You caused me so much suffering, but you didn't deserve this. Rest in peace, balloon kid. Be calm. I will be calm. Never mind, I'm not gonna be calm because you keep missing these crits, Cosmo. At least Ziggy's carrying us. Am I close to the end? No, I'm close to the end of disc one, but I'm not close to the end of the game at all. We still got a lot more to do. I wish everyone was as good as you are. Ziggy. She doesn't suck today. She's been doing fine. Uh, epic. There you go. There's that, Chris. Okay, good job. Oh, yeah, you've seen nothing yet. You've seen nothing yet. I already talked to you. Turn around. Yes, thank you. Here we go! 
Why can you not use Fallen Eagle on them? I, they're freaking... Whatever. I don't care. It doesn't matter. Keep using Lunar Blade, bro. Ow, two Devil Breaks and you're not freaking broken yet. Fine, take that. <laughs> That's fine. Alright, Cosmos, you can get a crit right here. This is awesome. Man. I don't know what I expected. Alright. Um, you know what? We'll let you get... Oh, you got another one. Hind. All oh, a medium fire attack. I didn't even realize you had another special attack now, Ziggy. Does anyone else have special attacks? Let's check. I want to check what shion has got here. She's got lock shot. That seals boost. Not useful against certain enemies. It doesn't do that much, but you know what? There, it's there. I think he's level 29. What a legend. He's carrying the team right now. I didn't want to use the fire attacks. I don't think these things take much damage from fire. Don't worry, I'll Why? Why are there more of you? Um, I think he's running out of EP again, which is not that unexpected. TBH. This isn't gonna kill unless I get a bunch of crits, is it? Still didn't kill at 1,759 damage. Man! Pain. Pain. I have no health left. Hi. Uh, this one's gonna be a pain to kill, isn't it? Because I don't have any more EP on Ziggy. I'm close to a save point, but we're really close to one. Okay. Don't do that. Nice double. M Buster. Oh, I had a new Cosmos ability that I wanted to use soon. Ah, that didn't hurt that much. I thought it was gonna be worse. The most difficult boss? What do you mean, most difficult boss? Eliminated. Systems. I know what boss is next. I wouldn't call it the most difficult. Press circle. Welcome to the challenge, Coop. Oh my gosh, I already got this money. Thank you. Before I buy, let's go ahead and save, just in case I make bad decisions. Thank you for visiting. Would you like to make a purchase today? Yes. Buy equipment. Yes, we got new weapons for everyone now. Um, this will raise Cosmos' attack at the cost of defensive values. Do we really need defense, though? Do we really need defense? Well, we're definitely going to get a, um, this for Xion. Um, I want to get... Yeah, this this will be really good for Jin. Eh, we'll upgrade Momos as well. And Rockstar for Ziggy. This for Cosmos. Junior and yeah, y'all can live with bad stuff, that's fine. Let's see. 
It's a big upgrade for Momo's defensive stats, and she gets pretty good break limit from that. I'll probably buy that. I lose evasion, but I get significantly more stats everywhere else, so we'll definitely get this. Um, Jin. No, we're not buying anything for Jin. He's got a swimsuit. His swimsuit, so he can have um, really good stuff. His crit rate, at least. Yo, Gustav armor. Plus 10 strength for Ziggy. Oh, man. That's, that's some good stuff right there. Alright. Panther Eye, display data and health plus 300. That's a, just a better version of um, what we got on Xion right now, I think. Yeah. Let's just go ahead and take that. Dog Tag gives more break limit. Um, clean Jack. Flame Avatar, Lightning Avatar, Ice Avatar, Beam Avatar. These are just better versions of these where we get health in addition to the uh, bonus effect here. Um... Yeah, we're probably going to want Flame Avatars for the upcoming fight. I've already got two Crimson Rings, so... Let's just go ahead and buy... Let's just buy two of these, I guess. I don't know if the rest really matter right now. We'll just buy two of those for now. Hmm. Actually, let's get beam avatars as well. Get two of those for later. And now we gotta do some bunch of equipping. First of all, let's equip all the new weapons and armor on my characters I plan to use. Bang Z went all the way up to 84 strength. That's going to be really good. Um, and get your health all the way up to freaking 4,502. You'll be extremely difficult to kill, won't you? Um, except for your break limit being kind of low. That's unfortunate. Um... I could get the dog tag. I don't think he actually needs that much health, and that would make make his break limit not terrible. I could give that to someone else. Mm. Who do I want to give the witch's eye to? I kind of need her break limit not to be bad either, but I need someone to be able to... Just buy, let's buy two dog tags while I'm thinking about it, actually. Break limit plus 150. Could be useful. Um... Yeah, that'll give you a pretty good break limit there. That means only Shion might not have a great break limit here, but... Nah, I can leave her with the red star, maybe. Or the Witch's Eye, which will still give her a decent break limit. And she'll have the ability to use Erdkaiser and all that. Um... Well, if I all types of status ailments, that could actually be pretty useful to have on her for now. Um. So where's the um flame avatar? I only bought. Did I buy? I bought two of them. I thought. Who did I give the other one to? Am I stupid? I swore I bought two of them. Or can you not equip? Hold on. Can she not equip the... She can't. What the heck? I didn't know she couldn't equip, um... Elemental things. Okay, that's kind of annoying. Um, we'll give that to Jin then. 
He has like zero break limit though. No, I'll use Jin for the next fight instead of Cosmos. Cosmos will get used plenty through this run, so let's go ahead and do this, I guess. Um, no poison. Yeah, I guess this is fine. Let's see, I think this is the best one, right? Yeah. We can have that, I guess. Why not? I don't know if I actually need Talisman on anyone or not. Probably not. Um, I guess I wouldn't need to display data if I already know the enemy weakness, but you know what, we'll just have it anyway. Pretend we don't. Alright, let's save, I guess. Yeah, I didn't even realize she couldn't equip that. I was like, wait, where's my stuff? That's fine, though. She'll get to be used plenty. I do want to use Xion for the next fight, and Ziggy or Jin and Jin are just good. I'm sorry I haven't been using these three that much. Um, I'm planning to use Junior a little bit later. Um, Momo will have a good section coming up. I, I don't know when to use Chaos. I really don't. Press the switch. Yes. Oh, we saved them. Before this happened, I was seriously angry at you for messing with this my store's shutter. But now that I think about it, thanks to you, I was saved. Here, have this deluxe ice cream as thanks. We got a deluxe ice cream. Awesome. Awesome. Do I have rare steel on Xion? Um... Does she get that automatically, or what? I don't know. If it's not on this route, then... If she gets it automatically, then I, if I've leveled up far enough, I've got it. I don't know if I can actually see my, um... stuff right now. Oh, I can. I do have rare steel. Yeah, I got rare steel. I haven't, I haven't been using it. The online shop got new items. I literally just did that. Thank you, though. <laughs> Thank you, though. Are your wounds healed? Yeah, it sure is noisy outside. Did something happen? It looks like there's a battle going on. A battle? The Federation descent operation. You aren't going to fight? I'm not made for combat, but if necessary... I've seen Reallians fight numerous times. I was taught that that's what they do. That they'll kill even children without any hesitation. Unless instructed, Reallians won't kill people or each other. It is you humans who issue that order. So it's all the work of human beings, huh? You feel different than the others somehow. Different from normal Reallians. It's because I'm half human. Half human? Oh, Xion, what's the matter? Febronia, the sky, and the people! They're combat realities. This is bad. They're out of control. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> 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 Please take Xion and get away from here. No, 
You can't reason with them. It's all right. Don't worry about me. <laughs> Hurry! Petronia! Stop! Don't! <laughs> Get out of my way! Get away from her! <sighs> supposed to do stop it all of you you're no better than us ah! Ah! hey you think you can run can you run good girl now go get as far away from here as you can but don't go to the city here, use this key. You can get to Labyrinthos from the forest. Go back to your family. You understand? Good. Now go! Gunshots. This is one of my favorite moments in the game, unironically. This is a really good section of the game. Virgil! Don't come any closer! You've got to get away from here! Just standing there. Leave now. Hurry. Damn it. You fool. Get a hold of yourself. Feb died to save you. Now stand up. Damn it. Damn it. Shion. What? Realians can share information, right? Yes, they're capable of sharing the information from individual units. Shion's in danger. I have to save her. The girl! I gave her the key to the old gate to Labrinthos and sent her running. They probably sent that information to the others. I have to catch up to her. She's in danger. Okay, grab onto me. Thanks. Virgil, why did you decide to help Xion? Is there something strange about that? I'm a soldier, but I'm still human. I have a heart. I'm not like those Realian cannibals. No. Oh. What's wrong? Take this. What is it? It's the Realian self-destruct code. Uh, how do you have that? I can't tell you that, but it could come in handy. Only use it as a last resort. All right. Damn it! They're already 
the enemies in front! Damn, it's them! Xion, we're surrounded. Xion, this way. There are fewer enemies in front. We'll break through. Xion, hurry! Just a little further. Hang in there. Leave me behind. I'm in no shape to run. I'm just gonna slow you down. Something. Even after all of this, I never got your name. Virgil! Virgil. <laughs> <laughs> So touching. Virgil! <gasps> they did a number on her, huh? Now she's just an object. Oh, wait. She was already just a tool to begin with. How can you say that? She was trying to protect you. She decided to do that on her own, and then died on her own. Why should I be responsible? Virgil! What about you? You love to go on about Realian rights, but you gave me that code. What made you change your mind? I... I wanted to save you, so I... So you decided to off the Realians? No. It's not like that. What are you embarrassed about? That's basic human instinct. And humans are driven by impulse to destroy. Destruction serves as a way to feel out others and confirm your own existence. Then, you try to find atonement to comfort yourself after you're unable to deny your instincts. I tried to live exactly like that. And you've lived for that same purpose. You disassembled realities and dreamed of giving consciousness to inorganic matter. Comforting yourself with a hatred towards your father and anger over your mother's death. You're doing things you don't want to do just to escape your own feelings of guilt. Hypocrite. The word doesn't even begin to describe you. Be more true to yourself. What makes you think you understand me? Oh, I understand you. Because you and I are the same kind of person. What is it that drives you? <gasps> that's right. Revenge. Only revenge drives you and me, and that's the truth. Ideals crumble easily. Hope is like a mist before the morning sunrise of reality. That's exactly how I was. But then I learned. Nothing will change. There is a limit to will. The limit of this world in which everything is closed. Yes, that is what all of us came to understand. Stop! I don't want to hear anymore! Virgil, you protected me as a child, and now... Why do you do these things to tear at my heart? Why do you testaments appear before me? Why won't you leave me alone? Come on, that's not what you really feel. You're glad I still exist. You're happy he still exists. No, no, I... Come. 
come. Come and you will see. Then choose. Choose what you truly desire. You met him. He's with us. I don't understand. He was a testament. I can't just suddenly accept that. That's not what your will is saying. Your heart throbs for him. You feel passion for him. You want to see him, don't you? He wants to see you, too. Stop it. Stop talking to me. Xion, you mustn't listen to him. Don't be foolish. This doesn't concern you. Just keep quiet and stay out of my way! Virgil, the Blue Testament. It's been a long time, our decisive battle against this guy. So if you're confused why, I'm, I'm sure no one is if you watched the entire thing, but that was, the Virgil that just died was the Virgil of 15 years ago, not the current one that we see right now, who is a testament. A reminder that testaments are dead people, so it's fine that he's still here. Alright, let's see. How do I want to open this up? What are you weak to? Alright. I think we're going to open up with an Erdkaiser. Erdkaiser! And the song playing in the background is the Testament theme, by the way. It's the same song that was just playing in the cutscene, but it's also playing for the fight. Okay, crit. That should do some break damage. That should this. Come at me with everything you've got. This thing doesn't know restraint. Overtaker. Boost charge rate greatly increased. Um, that might be a little concerning, but it'll be fine, right? I'm just gonna keep using break, break my break move on you. We'll get you broken soon, don't you worry. Skeletal Slash. 541. Ah, good hit. Ouch. Blizzard 2. Okay, we're fine. I think he'll be almost ready to break after this, and then once we get him broken, we can kind of wreck him. Because we got Ziggy. And Ziggy's really good. <laughs> Ziggy's really good. <laughs> Alright. Don't revenge him! Stop that. Um. Not quite broken yet. Hey, what's wrong? Uh oh, he boosted. Uh oh, don't kill Jin. Okay, he didn't target me. All right. And it's time for us to use offensive. Yep, I think we're gonna win right here. Just a second. Nice, one thousand four hundred crit. Go Ziggy, it's time. Two thousand one hundred fourteen. Easy fight. Easy fight. Looks like you can fight, at least a little. Oh my God. <laughs> Please, stop. 
Please, don't confuse Xi'an anymore. Wait, what is this? Just who the hell do you think you are, showing up now? Oh, Pep. <laughs> Louis, why do you reject the truth? You can't change anything unless you accept who you really are. You're the same as those who lost their bodies and wander aimlessly. <laughs> You're no different either. You're just like me, now that you've lost your body. Please, you must accept who you really are. You don't hate anyone. You just want to reject yourself because you can't feel hatred. You don't know anything about me! But I do understand you. And you have come to understand us realians as well. <laughs> <laughs> and this was the result. Yeah, I came to understand, all right. I understand how pointless it all is. Lewis. Enough talking! Do you really think that I'm still hanging on to you? I feel nothing for any of you realians. That's not true. And you know it, Louis. You have returned to this place for a reason. You chose to become a testament so you could return here. Because this moment proved who you once were. This is my reason? This is my proof? Don't make me laugh. I regret absolutely nothing. I am here. Precisely because I have finally accepted myself and this world. Those of you who reject this world, you could never understand. We do not reject this world. We just want to believe in a new order that can be born from discord. We just want to believe that a single thought can change the entire world and shape the future. That is just wishful thinking. You're only clinging to what little hope you have left. Anything can come true, if you wish for it to. Didn't our relationship prove that, Louis? You died and left me! I have nothing to say to you! I know. You have suffered. My death tied your consciousness to this place. But I want to help you, Louis. I want to free you from this cursed place forever. Just leave me alone! You're already dead, Fabronia! Louis, although my body is dead, I am still here with you. I am right beside you. There's no reason for you to suffer. But I... I couldn't even save you. No. You're wrong. You did save me. You taught me that by sharing all of our feelings that we would be able to change the world. And that alone was more than enough. Do you hate me? None of this would have ever happened. If you hadn't gotten involved, why did you have to? Why? It's too much to bear. All I want, all I really want, is for you. Let's go now, Louis. She can show us the way to a future for both humans and realians. you believe in your heart. Have faith. Believe in yourself. Open your heart because she's right beside you. Sam! Please don't go! Sam! No! I don't understand anything anymore! Thank you. She...
Fab. Shion. Jin? Shion, stand up. I know you're in pain. But right now we have to save the girl. We have to save you. That is absolutely one of my favorite moments in the game. That entire like sequence, um, really, really good sequence. Honestly, that is going to be the end of Virgil and Febronio. I really like how you, when you meet Fer Virgil in the first game, you just think he's just like this massive racist against Realian, and then you learn that like he actually secretly loved—not even secretly, but he loved Realian the entire time. And because other Realians killed his girlfriend, he just—that's the reason he was so resentful and spiteful towards them the entire time. Um, I think there was a lot of really good, um, I, I think, I think Virgil's probably one of the best, he's one of my favorites, I think. I have him, like, on, on my totals, you know, character tier list in, like, A tier or something. He's a, he's a really good character overall. Um, he's had a lot of really, like, stuff to mess with Xion and, like, get in her head as well. Um, which was interesting insight into her character as well, because Xion couldn't really deny or refute it either. Which is, um, something I thought was really good about that cutscene as well. And, um, yeah, Virgil's really cool. I know he seemed like some generic racist evil guy that Cosmos offed in the first 10 minutes of the first game, but he actually ends up being important and cool, so that's nice. <laughs> that's going to cover it for this episode. We finally see the conclusion of Virgil and why he ended up being how he was and his relationship with Febronia. I think Virgil's a great character. I hope you guys have come to appreciate him as well. And um, next time on Xenosaga 3... We are going to find Xion, the young Xion, that ran off again. We're going to have to go save her again. And we're going to hopefully wrap up this section pretty soon here. So thank you all so much for watching. Have a wonderful day.